Thanks for rolling up to the Murray Certified Pothead. Just finished smoking uh second blood in the morning. I'm, I'm, I'm smoke, bro. Let's uh jump in, bro. It's not even a waste of time. I gotta grab me something to eat and shit in a second. Let's uh jump in, bro. A debate is underway about whether or not a marijuana dispensary should go in Florence. 22 News reporter Kay Wilkinson is live from the Hampshire County Bureau in Northampton with the latest. Pizza oh. Where is this at? Florence, I don't know. I don't know where this is at. WWLP, this is East Coast because it's a W. Running letter for the for those of face, they may they may say where this is. Factory will remain open until the end of this year. They're planning to close once their lease runs up. But in its place could go a pot shop, and some aren't too happy about that. What did what did it say? It was a it was a. Kay Wilkinson is live from the Hampshire County Bureau in Northampton with the latest. Pizza Factory will remain open until the end of this year. They're planning to close once their lease runs up. But in its place could go a pot shop. And some aren't too happy about that. Okay, so they're closing the pizza shop and opening up a weed shop? What's, what's the issue? That, 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 you know what I mean? Florence, Florence is an old town with old people who don't, who don't, who don't, who don't like weed. Is that the problem? It's just wrong. Rick Haggerty lives near downtown Florence. When he heard a marijuana dispensary could go where the pizza factory currently stands, he started a petition that has nearly 300 signatures. He feels the site could be too close to schools and substance use recovery centers. It could be too close to schools. I mean, you know how close, you know how far schools are from that place. So it either is or it isn't. There's no could about that. Not anti pot. You know, a lot of people benefit from it, but it's a bad location for children and people in recovery. Haggerty plans to attend a public outreach meeting August 15th at 6 30 p.m. In a statement to 22 News, Mayor Gina Louise Shera said, My office has been notified about the community outreach meeting in Florence scheduled by Euphorium LLC according to the CCC process. Meantime, Haggerty is calling on the city council to put a cap on the number of dispensaries in North. Hampton. How much demand really is there for uh, for pot? How much demand is there for pot? What the hell do you mean, bruh? What the hell do you mean, bruh? There's an unlimited demand for that shit. You cannot have enough of a supply. You cannot have too much of a supply for weed. You'll never have too much of a supply. It's a question Ashish Sadiq from Northampton also has. He feels the city should look at other types of businesses to bring in more options for residents. It's like so what do you do? Uh, so what? Every store, every store is a weed shop. Now, if you go, if you say every store is a weed shop, then I understand what you're saying. But there's no way that that's what you're talking it's about. Clear to me whether this this small city can actually support so many dispensaries just as a business. How many dispensaries are in Florence? And 22 News did speak with the people at the pizza factory. They said that they understand people's frustrations, but at the end of the day, they do not have control over who exactly takes over their space once their lease runs up at the end of this year. Review live from the Hampshire County Bureau in Northampton, Kate Wilkinson, 22 News. Yeah, yeah. Unless, unless I mean the people of Florence are going to go start buying more pizza from the pizza factory so that you know what I mean they they can they can they can keep their lease and shit y'all niggas is about to get a weed shop y'all niggas is about to get a weed shop and it's not even a bad thing it's not a bad thing um hey bro be, be positive bro have a positive outlook on stuff getting another weed shop will not be bad who knows like 20 more people might get a job that don't have a job right now be positive, my dog. 